it's really interesting in this field. Um, they basically, uh, it's interesting, uh, different growers have different practices, right? Uh, some growers do plant a lot of um, beneficial habitat plants, you know, like alyssum, phacelia, uh, these different um, habitat plants, which are, provide nectar for um, the uh, beneficial insects. So the beneficial insects being like tiny wasps. And the, and the wasps need those flowers to get pollen and nectar, uh, and then they go off and, um, and then uh, parasitize, basically, aphids. Uh, you also have surface flies. There are some surface flies uh, flying around here. But, um, but they're here, and there's, um, there's a lot of ladybugs, too. But um, really, the surface flies um, is, a, is one of the key uh, predators. And they, they lay uh, their eggs on the plants, and then their, their larvae actually um, are um, their um, predators in that they consume the aphids. They don't just parasitize them. And um, so they're, um, they're very active. And also uh, the beneficial uh, habitat, uh, like alyssum and so forth, uh, also feeds the adults of these uh, hoverflies that are flying around. And this farm, uh, this, the rotations here, um, I think, are, are um, important to understand in terms of how they affect production. And so here they grow a lot of leafy green vegetables, so like lettuce and spinach. But they also will rotate with uh, coal crops like um, broccoli and cauliflower. But they also do um, some uh, baby vegetables too, so like uh, baby kales, baby uh, Swiss chard, and baby lettuce. Um, and uh, so those, all those things kind of feed into um, kind of what you're seeing here in terms of the weed pressure is actually kind of pretty low here uh, because uh, the types of rotations and the things that they're growing, they've been able to um, really control the weeds very nicely. And then um, on, a, on a field of lettuce here in the Salinas Valley, one of the things we're really concerned about are uh, foliar diseases, uh, but also um, soil-borne diseases. And that's why I mentioned the rotations. That's very important, uh, having those coal crops in the rotation. Uh, things like broccoli actually help to reduce problems with uh, certain soil-borne diseases like verticillium and fusarium. This is why agricultural research is so important 